I'll show you how to create an approval process in Salesforce. You go to Setup, and in Quick Find box, you type over here approval processes. You come here under Process Automation. Um, approval process is the approval of a record upon some conditions by different stakeholders and individuals. Um, approvals are com complex business processes that require information gathering and planning before implementing it. It is recommended that you follow the instruction below before getting started. You have to read this with the checklist create. So let's start with the um, approval process there's a button here create uh, new approval process you, you can go to wizard or use a st you can use a standard setup wizard um, you, you can use a jump wizard or the standard setup wizard let's do the standard setup wizard uh, process name test approval process AP stand for approval process um, specify the entry criteria let's say account do we have any account status here Um, let's see um, you have to select the field for the entry condition you can see the related field on account um, object fields I select account rating equals hot it's a hot account so we need some approval for that yeah select the field use for automated approval rating standard user fees manager I select the manager checkbox here administrators only can edit record during the approval process I'll select the default just for the email template I have some email template but I use it it needs to be sent in order to be approved right so fields select field to display the approval page layout selected fields account site active Security settings allow approval to access the approval page only from within the Salesforce application. So I'll take the default. Allowed submitters, account owner. Page layout setting, which this is checked. Add the submit for approval button and approval history related list to all company page layout. Submission settings allow submitters to recall approval requests. I'll uncheck it. I'll take the defaults. 
it's already created if you want to create a pull process now for the sake of testing it has for that yes I would like to create an approval step now test yes approval test step number one all records should enter this step or you have two criterias default all records should enter this step enter the step with the following I just take the default select the approver automatically assign the user field selected earlier the manager okay manager needs to approve it how, how would you like to know uh, if you you have just created an approval step you can optionally specify the workflow action occur upon approval or rejection on this step uh, yes I would like to get a new approval action for this step task this is a task date create a date plus five days this is a task so this is what approval process we have process definition initial submission action approval step final approval action final reject action recall actions going to activate it I activated it So let's go to uh, accounts. Actually, it is uh, companies. I rename to company. Uh, rename the account to re uh, companies earlier. Slow here. Company name ABC test. You see the rating, it's a hot. So, approval process will be kicked off upon creating an account with the status hot. 